Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another edition of Smokey Prince. My name's Smokey McGee. You can call me Jason. Either one works just fine. Today, I wanted to go ahead and talk about how you can make your simple designs with 3D printing pay for themselves, or at least help you pay for your hobby in general. Um, I'm not out here trying to make a million dollars off of my prints, but I am trying to make this hurt a little bit less when I want to pick up my filament or even a new printer or maybe some parts. Um, so today we're going to talk about making your 3D prints work for you. If this is the type of content that you're into, do me a favor. Let me know down in the comment section below. How are you making your prints work for you? And if you haven't done it already, do me a favor. Hit the sub, hit the like, hook a brother up. And on that note, let's go ahead and jump in how I how I've been making my prints work for me. So as some of you know, I do a little bit of remixing. So I do helmets, I, helmets, and well, a lot more helmets. I've recently uploaded a few new items. Um, so I designed this coin. It's basically, uh, if you can read it, I'm not gonna say it out loud because YouTube doesn't like that. Um, but this has basically banked me $120 in the last two days on Maker's World. So we're gonna go ahead and go to Google. We're gonna go Maker's World. And just like that, this is the ecosystem for everything bamboo. Now, if you're not familiar with bamboo is, where have you been? Get out from underneath that rock. No, um, they're a string of printers, some of the best on the market, but they have their own ecosystem that they're trying to build for designers in, in order to incentivize designers or people who do remixes or want to upload files, they are incentivizing us by giving us perks. So in the last, I don't know, like two, three weeks, um, I, here, we'll go to my profile, I have uploaded probably, well, I guess 50 different models or designs. Um, now, I don't do any of my own, well, I, can, I can't, take, can't say that actually. I don't do a lot of my own full designs. Almost 99% of everything that I've uploaded is a remix. So I took these base helmets and I stamped them with these logos, threw them up there, and every time somebody downloads, I get credit. Now it's not like a point for download, but it is like 25 points for every 25 downloads and so on and so forth. What, they like your profile that you've uploaded? They think that how you did this, you get a rating, you get points for that as well. And there's just so many different, if you have a whole bunch of different items that people can download, the more chances you have that they'll actually click on them and or give you a, a solid like rating. Um, now with something like this, the coin, it was so simple. I was bored at work while sleeping there, oddly enough, um, and designed this in probably like 30 minutes. Um, and I uploaded it the next day and it just kind of blew up. And I actually just recently got another Okay, I, I believe this coin alone is, like I said, banked me about 120 bucks. Now, when I say banked me 120 bucks, so if you look right over here, there's Maker's Rewards. We're going to click on here, and you can actually get free rewards just by rating other people's prints, um, as well as uploading a model, upload a print profile, which is... Uh, so you slice something and you make it better. So you can download somebody else's model, slice it better, upload that model, and get credit when people use your slice. It's crazy how this works. Um, and then complete personal profile, and then rating profiles. So as you rate people's profiles, you are getting credit. Now, not a lot. I like maybe four points at a time, but every point counts. And when I say that, I mean this. So if you look at my transaction history, I, I've redeemed for gift cards, um, but three points, four points, eight points, 25, four points. Like I have 20 pages of this and it's publishing models, everything like that. You get credit. And when I redeem these things, each one of these gift cards is worth 40 bucks. That's crazy. 
as of right now, I could have basically bought an A1 Mini with just uploading remixes for different prints. Now, if you're someone like me and you have a wall full of filament, that is really not the cheapest thing to have. But if you're doing this, this can help supplement some of that hurt out of your pocket from just doing the thing that you're already going to be doing. And if you're designing stuff for yourself, like for instance, uh, we needed a shelf for my fridge. So what did I do? I took my handy dandy calipers. I measured the inside of my fridge uh, like shelf and I made a larger version of this. I made an actual print shelf, um, which is here right here. Um, this may not get a lot of downloads, but guess what? I'm going to upload it. Why? Because I made it. It's an original design. Nobody else has it. So why not? And even if it weren't a completely original design, I can say that I just remixed it. And as long as I'm giving credit to the person who originally did the file, like we'll go to the Star Wars helmet. Um, let's see. It Yeah, it, it actually gives credit. This remix is based on... And there's the helmet. You're giving credit to the original maker. Now, I actually don't even know what happens when I'm getting credit for their design, even though all I did was stamp it. Um, so chances are they're probably getting credit too. So it's a trickle-down effect that everybody's winning here. Um, this may have sounded like a rant, but I really think that this is kind of neat and everybody should know about this whether you choose to upload your designs or not just know that you don't have to be paying full price for all of your filaments or your printers if you wanted to go that extra step and start uploading rating or doing other things to help yourself out with um well with your hobby because let's face it if you're 3d printing you know it's not the cheapest hobby to have so, but this wasn't supposed to be a really long video. I just wanted to go ahead and get this out of the out of the way and let you know that you too can do this. I did just upload this uh, Gengar uh, phone charger because, well, I, I kind of wanted it. Um, I don't know. Side note. But hey, if you enjoyed this video, let me know down in the comment section below. I love your face, and I will see you next time. Deuces.